one to, uh, well, this might be part 10, I believe, to our Caribbean little mini campaign here. Actually, it's just becoming a full campaign. I don't understand why I'm having a great time with it, and we're so early on in it, and whatever. We'll just keep playing as the game progresses and gets better. But, uh, I came over to Lamon here because I got some letter saying that there was something for me to pick up, and then I don't know why, but I, I just... For whatever reason, there was something, and I can't actually go back and look at what uh, what it was even. Um, uh, it was something um, right here for the script error. Uh, extra good ready at main menu notifications. So I don't. Uh, it was like go to talk to some person to pick something up, and. I don't even remember what the guy's name was either now, for some whatever reason as well. So I don't know exactly know what it was, but I came down here to see if there was some prompt for when I got here, but there was not. So I decided to, well, we'll continue on with what we were going to do before, and start raiding some of these uh, other villages around here. So I was walking down the street all enjoying my time, and we got this guy, these desperados out here. And it would appear that they're 50 jungle fighters, okay? So well, let's go, I'm going to hit them on the road and see what happens as they have some Dutch colonial militias and whatnots. So we'll go straight at them. And uh, yeah, pain and suffering. So 56 versus 50 and their jungle troops, we will charge the enemy. And I believe should be no problem, right? Because we have the beautiful cannon, so we'll stand back. Um, actually, if you would be so kind as to stand over here. Uh, some... We already got some script errors going on. What gunnery bot division six fire enemy infantry division? I don't know what's happening. Uh, we already know that I don't kill my own guys, so that's always nice. Um, I have let's see, those well, pikemen's and stuff. We'll put you guys, you know, right here. Where's the one guy? What is that? Yeah, you guys move up here and put your pikes up close. And someone already got blasted by those cannons. I heard that shot. Oh, jeez. Jeez. Scheisse. I do believe I missed, but, you know, jungle fighters here. Looks like they're just going to charge right in. Oh, when I got that guy. I really hope I don't lose anyone. <laughs> I actually got that dude. Yeah. Oh, they're running. Ah, they're running away. Alright. Reload my, uh, my flintlock here on the go. That would be quite difficult, I gotta say. Um, he's got some practice though. Oh, they made it right off the map. Oh. Alright then. That was quick and easy. What happened? No casualties. That guy didn't do anything running up. He was courageous, though. Party gains 14 morale and 23 renown. I did notice that uh, these rescued prisoners... Uh, there's nothing I can do about these because my party is full. Oh, I can hire one guy. Mm, yeah, you know... Um, he would be on horseback as well. Oh. That'd be interesting. A merchant guard, huh? Uh, would be kind of fun to have another guy on horse, but no real need. Maybe I'll just take that No, because then they're just going to lose morale as I go take these Dutch towns. I really would like to, um, I think, you know, get the prisoner thing up. Oh, some more desperados and more jungle fighters. Okay, and those guys ran away. Oh, where do you think you're running off to, man? just booked it into the trees. What happened? You saw what happened to the other guys? Alright. Well, as long as nobody comes over here to uh, interfere, I will um, raid this village. Taking also action. I plunder everything. Ships, villages, no matter. Um, stand fast, boys. Stand fast. Everyone, positions. 
I think the guns will be up front. Scratch my ear here. Let's see what they do. Are they going to actually... Oh, they are going to come across. Let's see. It was... Yep, yep, yep. Can we put these pikemen in front? Forward, pikemen. Well, you... The best would, you know, be if... Uh, got that farmer. Can we shoot past our guys, or are we going to shoot our own dudes? I always wondered about that. But, we got those pikemen out there. We'll see. So far, just blue. I got another one. Oh no, a couple of pikemen went down. Killed by farmer. Not something you want to see. Oh my gosh, I hit a friendly troop. I don't think I hit a friendly troop. I think that was a little, uh, a little silly. Especially being on horseback here. Oh, I was just gonna shoot that guy. So I don't think we shoot our own guys, or maybe they do. How many pikemen would we do this lose? Anybody? Tell me, which one of you shot our own guys in the back, huh? Which one of you did it? I'll have your ass for that. Where are you going? You gonna try and flank me? I'll take you with a fist. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's, I love the, I love having the the gun and the pistol. No, don't you throw anything at me. Yeah. All right. No, I saw two pikemen go down, but. I love walking amongst my cheering men. Seven killed, only one were wounded. Oh, that's all right. Raise this bitch. Steal everything. Leave nothing. That's all right. We can always go and get some more men. There are plenty. You receive an invitation to service. Ah, Kingdom of Spain has sent a messenger to bring you an offer written in his own hand. You would be granted the honor of becoming a noble of the Kingdom of Spain. In return, Garcia de Sotomayor, 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 yeah, Sotomayor, I can't even say that, ask you to swear an oath of servitude to him and fight in his <laughs> military campaigns, offering you the settlement of Chinicota. To govern, he will surely be offended if you do not take the offer. Hey, you know, this is kind of fun. You know, I thought maybe I would join the English, but you know what? Let's join the Spanish. I know I've been raiding your villages all over the place, and uh, it just seems kind of fitting that I <laughs> that I take control of it. Um, I even think I've raided this town that he's talking about. Um, uh, yeah, I think I've actually raided that town. Uh, I will accept this invitation, a beautiful honor. Uh, in order to become a noble of the realm, you must swear oath of servitude to Garcia. And you shall have find him and give him your oath in person. Garcia is currently in the moon. So that was probably what I got to go and... Uh, I... Gosh damn it. Can I go back? Our toll is five... Okay, just, just take it. I, um... What... Come here, you. Give me, give me my money back. <laughs> yeah. Charge the enemy. I don't know, gave him 580 of my coin. I don't want one of this crap. Stand fast, boys. Stand fast. Let's see. How's our positioning? Not fantastic. Where are they coming from? Pull out the spyglass. Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? Not here. There they are. Alright, the boys are lined up. Give me the uh, pikemen. You guys can scoot up a bit there. I don't know why you stand so far back, but. <clears throat> Let's go, uh. Let's go closer to these these bastards that I gave my 500 coin to. 26 men. 
I didn't see the number when I, and then I clicked so fast that that was just an accident all around. What did you just do? Don't shoot me! Don't shoot me! Sounds like someone's got a galley gun. What's going on over here? Keep up the fire, boys. Oh, I'm not afraid of you. <laughs> this guy was ripped. <laughs> He's gonna have this steel there. What a farmer. No. No, don't let him run. Don't shoot me either. You guys are crazy. Right in the top of the head. Oh, that's the edge of the map. Seriously, someone's firing a repeating cannon. I think they ran away from us. Does that mean I can acquire my, uh... My 580 coin that was... That I accidentally gave that poor bastard because I clicked too quickly? Oh, he just missed. Cool, look, look at that. Oh, you can ride out to the beach. Let me get this loaded up here. Oh, there he is. Oh, I should try to take a shot. Alright. No casualties. And you got the 457. Yes, basically we got our coins back. Okay. So back to Limon. And there they run away. Okay. Let's go. We are joining the Spanish. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, that just seems fun. Why not? You know, you can easily... Um, relations with Thomas Lynch has increased. Why? Oh, where is Thomas Lynch? Oh, you know, this was another... Okay, 40-some men. We will fight to the last man. Yeah, 47. I wish I could see what kind of men they were, but... Uh, we will charge the enemy. As my beautiful cannons. She'll... Speak the music of our people. Come over here. Load them up, boys. Load them up. Let's see, what kind of men are we fighting against here? Some more heartless bastards without any guns. The only ones I'm really afraid of are those bastards with the... Buccaneers, alright. Renegades. Like, the ones I'm afraid of are just the dudes with the grenades. Oh, I missed. Got that guy. A veteran renegade. Let's move it, and I'm trying to pull my pistol out. Yeah, take that. Jeez. That, sh that shrapnel shot is so cool. Got you. Loading. Oh, you dodged it. Oh, no part of that. They'll chase me and my boys can shoot them down. Oh, except for this funny palm tree that got laid over. Oh! Friendly fire! <laughs> Here, let me clip you in the back of the head. Oh, you guys did it! 
we say no to you. Try to defend the doors. Now let us in. I am here. I'd like to go to uh, the main square. I well, let's first go to the market. And I believe I have nothing. Oh, I already, did I already sell off the stuff that I... I didn't take anything. What happened to that town? Didn't we raise a town? We got nothing from that town. Terrible. I'm in the main square. I am here, Garcia. Thank you, sir. You honored me with your offer. To have my, val <laughs> my value finally recognized. Yeah, you know, that's alright. I'll be the humble one right now. Um, I let it... Let us be done with uh, formalities then, Captain Snow. Are you ready to swear your oath of service to me? Uh, yes, sir. Good. Report the words. Uh, repeat the words of the oath with me. I can't even do that part. And I swear homage to you as a lawful ruler of the Kingdom of Spain. As long as the gold, man. Just get the gold. Um, I need to think about this. I uh, mean, as loyal and devoted man, as long as my breath remains. Yes, and I will be at your side to fight your enemies should you need my sword. Yes. Finally, I will uphold your lawful claims and those of your legitimate heirs. Yes. And very well. You have given me your solemn oath, Captain Snow. May you uphold it always with proper courage and devotion. All right. Let it be known from this day forward. You are my sworn man and noble. I give you my protection and grant you the right to bear arms in my name. And I pledge that I shall not deprive you of your life, liberty, or properties, except by the lawful judgment of your peers or by the law and custom of the land. Furthermore, I appoint you as governor of the settlement of Chinook. Ch Chinakota, with all its rents and revenues. Excellent, Captain Snow. Serve me well, and you will rise high. Thank you, my lord. So, how about that? Um, I just lost... <laughs> what happened here? Um, friend, everyone to zero, because no one likes me now, because I'm particular with Spain. I have great hopes for you, and Captain Snow. I know you shall prove yourself worthy of the trust I have placed in you. That is quite awesome. Um, so, uh, now that I have done this, let's go, I need to hire some soldiers, sir, and, uh, since I am now part of sp the Spanish peoples, I need to acquire, let's see, Spanish colonial musketeers or marine musketeers, interesting, let's take, how about some of these guys, 157, oh, let's recruit, uh, 10 of them? Here's your money. And uh, maybe some Spanish Colonial Guard? Yeah, how about that? Uh, ten of them. Oh, I can only recruit one? Okay, see you later. Uh, what I probably want might want to do here is that the judge of Echina could have resigned from his service. Yeah, that's because it's mine. Mine, I tell you, mine. So I figured out how to do this last time. You click this button and it shows you here. So I think I want to get rid of my English, my English peoples, potentially. I don't know how well it's going to work with them being on part of this. Uh, unit morale is above average. Okay, as long as the morale stays um, okay, then they can stay a part of my, my good little, my brigade of men, my, my valued people here. If the morale starts dropping because they are uh, they're English and they have to deal with the Spanish here, then I am going to slap them around and kick them to the curb. So let's go to my my place. It's uh, it's it's where is it? It's over here. Yeah, let's let's hightail it home. Not home, but I it's, I'm governor of this place. This would be cool. I suspect also that. Uh, what is it? Um, faction relations. Let's see. Kingdom of Spain is 13, so everyone else is now indifferent, and the Brotherhood of the Coast is now accepting, whereas they were not, which is interesting because they must have relations with Spain. So that's that's how that works, I guess. Company size report. Um, I can now have 60, what I had 56 before, which is very cool. And the character report. Uh, you serve the Kingdom of Spain. Your states are here and renowned 221. My honor is minus 24. I have no friends or enemies still, so that's okay. So sail we shall. Sailing north. Let's see. I wonder now, since I am with Spain, 
how often I will have to fight um, these other, the English or the French kind of thing. But uh, I feel a lot better now that I have 60 men here. So we will sail around. Um, a fleet of pirates. I am coming over here. I'm sure I will get letters now as well to come help on certain things, which would be good. Oh, mutineers. That would be cool. And there's a slaughtering going on over here. On your order, Francis Willow, uh, Willoughby has completed an carcass. You may now collect it. Uh, Caracas, I, that means I have to go somewhere down to get help. What is going on here? You guys are slaughtering bandits? Wait, first go back to town real quick. I need food. I should have realized that we'd run out of food before we got anywhere. For the goods. Um, what do we got? Beef? We'll take the beef. Smoked fish. More fish. And some pork. I love it. You guys want some fruits? We'll take fruits and bread. We'll take... You guys have a nice hearty meal. Eat hearty on me, my friends. For now, we are people of Spain. And here we go. Let's go check out what happens when we go to the place of our... Uh, oh, look it. I even have a Spanish flag flying high, which is pretty cool. All right, let's, whoa! They are slaughtering. That's a lot of people. Um, patrolling, yeah. I know I feel I have to keep my, my people safe here. I am here, and if you recognize me... Uh, well, actually, you shouldn't, because I have killed many. So, this village and the surrounding lands are ruled by you. The locals are hostile to you, minus 57. People on the streets say the old miller nearly had a stroke the moment he heard of the new mill. <laughs> the houses are in good repair and working hard to increase the prosperity. Uh, let's talk to the elder. Um, no, I don't, I don't really need to buy some supplies. I probably could have done that before. Um, I don't need to buy supplies from the peasants either. Um, but that might make them... Well, no, I really don't. So there's not much I can uh, actually go and do over here? Okay. Well, that's alright. Um, my party here. You know, everyone... Ah. Down to the medium morale, because we have to go, what, acquire a victory for our people? Alright. Oh, what is... Uh, that was the other thing I wanted to look at. Uh, the reports... Not this one exactly. Camp? No. Resume traveling. Uh, no. No. I thought it was under reports. No, it's uh, quest messages here. Nations? Um, can we go to Spain? Uh, <clears throat> to read these things. Uh, let's see. I mean, the Kingdom of Spain are governed by Garcia. Yeah, their colonies. All these places. I am the governor of here. Aha. Um, and all those kingdoms being include Captain Snow. Hey, hey. Um, yada, 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 yada. Foreign relations. The kingdom of Spain is currently at peace with England. At peace with France. Um, has a truce with the Netherlands. A uh, truce will expire in two days. And it currently at peace with the Brotherhood of the Coast. So, I... I don't... There will be no attacking other, other factions right now. It'll mostly just be looking to attack some other pirates, potentially. Or continuing with the, um, whatever, just the, the gray, non-factioned peoples. So, okay, that's good news. But there you have it. So we've acquired some new things. So we'll hang out at home for a little bit. And next part, I will go back out on the seas and look to explore and take some other, uh, take some other ships and acquire some other goods and whatnot. So we do have a little bit of cash, not a lot, but it should hold us over for a little bit. Um... The other thing would be nice to know if I don't have to pay for these guys anymore. Maybe the Kingdom of Spain would pay for my my soldiers, but probably not. Probably, probably not. Um, we are 60-60. Yeah, I can't do anything about it. So anyways, thank you all for watching this part, and I hope you don't mind that I joined the Kingdom of Spain. It is rather kind of cool, as we were offered this, and I accepted, and here it is. So, I'm Stowhood420. Of course, leave your thumbs up in comments, and maybe... Maybe some uh, ideas, you know, what what else could we can try to accomplish here? And I would, as soon as we go to war with somebody, it would be wise to, of course, you know, try and take 
some place, right? One of these ports or something like that? I don't... something like that. Anyways, I'll see you next time.